again. I want to thank everyone who watched my first video. I can't believe I've already got 30 viewers. It's amazing. Of course, most of them are my friends laughing. Yeah. Jorge. So after making the first video, right now I kind of I'm just frozen. I mean, I have a million things to talk about, but I don't know which one to choose, or how to start, or... I don't know. And I could talk about Harry Potter. Like I told you in my last video, I'm kind of obsessed. You saw the ooh thing, right? So, yeah. I used to talk about it a lot at school, but it's becoming a bit annoying to my friends. So, yeah, I'm kind of using this video log to talk about Harry Potter and leave my friends alone. But since they're the ones watching this, I don't know if we're doing anything, actually. So if I want to talk about Harry Potter, I'll probably need a whole video. So since I already started, I can't do it. Lucky you. Some other things I want to talk about were movies I recently watched. But I want to wait until more people have watched Clash of the Titans, since I want to kind of comment since they kind of ruined the whole myth. Yeah. But it was good, actually. Well, I'll comment in another video. Um, some other stuff were dreams. I have really crazy dreams. They're not porn. And the final thing I thought was a uh, video game. The one I'm playing right now is Kingdom Hearts 368 and a half days, which is the one you play with Roxas. It goes after Chain of Memories, you know, the one you played with cards. Ha! Ah, four races! Now, hand over the Keyblade! I guess this is what I'm going to talk about. And, as I said, this game goes after Chain of Memories, where Saurus... I haven't played... Well, I have the game, but I haven't actually played it since I really don't like the whole card thing. It's really annoying. And also, it just... It's like doing everything you did from the first game, so what's the point? Except you're in this whole castle. Castle Oblivion, I think it was called. I don't know if it's the same castle, though. So, well, as I said, you play with Roxas, who is working for the organization, and since I'm still not finished, I'm not really going to tell you all the spoilers and all the things that happen, since I don't know them myself, and if you want to play, I'm not going to ruin it for you. You do have to say it's really good, since you don't play with the cards. You play with the sword, the keyblade. And the thing is, it's like, um, there are several missions, so the organization sends you on missions to be Heartless and stuff, so I've been playing 15 hours, and it's mission, 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 mission. So it's not like in normal Kingdom Hearts where you're Sora, and you go from world to world looking for Kyrie and Riku, and the king, and everything else. So it's kind of, you're doing jobs, you're working. And you work with other people like Axel, a girl named Sion, or however you pronounce it, I don't know how. Um, and it's actually really cool because if you play the second one, you know all these characters. So you know, oh, this is the guy who I beat in Hercules, or this is the guy I, I got killed by in Beast's castle several things like that, it's, and it's actually cool, of course. I kind of don't like them, so, yeah. <laughs> no, but it's, it's interesting. So, I also wanted to say something. Um, one of my friends said that she didn't expect me to be a yay person, so I guess I am a yay person. I mean, I, I just noticed I say yay a lot. So, yeah, yay! So yesterday, I went with some of my friends to, to this mall, this shopping center called Sanadu. I'll put the name here. Yay. There I go again. <laughs> so, um, and I did a mini video because we were kind of in a hurry and I didn't get much time. And no one said anything, right? And, and then the typical friend is like, oh, no, don't, 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 don't. Yeah, so I'll put that up after this and show you, well, we went to the carts. So it was really cool. It was like, Mary Kart. It was like, <laughs> But, actually, it was a bit more real. It was really cool, since I really like the whole feeling the wind on your face, the turning, and it, it was really cool. But I thought it was really, really expensive. We were there for 10 minutes, and it cost 17 euros. 
So that kind of Hello everyone, we're right here at the shopping center called Zanadu, where there is a skiing thing, a cart thing, a mini golf thing, and let's go see the cart. Here's everyone getting ready. Anyway, we're here with Garmin and Desi. Say hi. My friends wanted me to talk about him. His name is Jorge. Jorge. This is Jorge. <laughs> and I've decided that I'm not going to talk about him. He's going to come here, or I'm going to take the camera up to him, and he's gonna. We're going to kind of interview him if he wants us to. Yeah. It's probably going to be a lot more fun since some other people also want to be on on this video log, which I hope they hurry so I can make more because I kind of like doing videos, yeah. So, Jorge, start practicing your English. Once again, thanks for watching. I hope I get time to make more videos in my near future, since on Tuesday I start school again, and it's going to be three tough weeks of exams, and then another couple weeks with even harder exams, and then which is like a big exam thing in Spain. So, yeah, I'm going to probably die in the process, but yay!